Hi, I'm Diane with Worth Beyond Rubies, and today we're going to be discussing a little bit about the topic of instant gratification and how to never settle for less. In my post on this topic, I mentioned the Hebrew word latzon. Latzon means will or desire. It's what we want, and often when we want it. We see this best in the example of Esau wanting stew because he was weary, and ultimately he relinquished his birthright for it. Latzon in this case caused him to despise something that was an immense blessing for him and caused him and his descendants to be lesser than his brother. We see Latzon in our desire to have a relationship with Hashem and with other people. We see it with friendships, with marriage, and even in our relationship with the Lord and to grow closer to him in our day-to-day -day lives. But our desires, our will to have something or to be in relationship with someone can be fleeting. We may desire our relationship with Hashem and like Esau, may want it when things seem out of control or when we feel like we just can't go on another minute without his help. But then when things are fine, it wanes. We want what we want, yes. And we often want it when we want it. We want him to answer prayer when we want it. And we may go all in and pray fervently, but when we no longer need it, do we still devote as much time to prayer and to study? Do we still have the need for the Lord that we did in that moment of distress? Like Esau would not have relinquished his birthright for the need for stew if he hadn't been so famished. Do we lose the intense thought zone of the moment? when we're no longer in that intense need. So let's turn our ratzon into a habit, a spiritual habit, not just when we have a need that needs to be met, but at all times. Turning the need for instant gratification into a constant need for the Lord that brings about that closeness with him at all times.